That said, as of this video being published, I'm done with Twitch. I've thought of a thousand different ways to record this, a thousand th different things to say, and none of it really worked. As soon as I sat down to record, <laughs> gone. Let's just go with... I think it's time for me to hang up the hat with streaming. I, I, I think my time as a streamer has reached its end. I started on YouTube in July of 2016. I found making videos to be a great creative outlet, a great passion. Something that I could learn to do that while I wasn't good at it, I knew I could get good at it. And it wasn't that I saw other people being good at it and like, mm, I could do that. And no, it's, I saw other people doing it and like, I want to do that. I, I found content creators on YouTube that were playing games, having fun, building communities, doing cool stuff. As things went on, I found streaming to be easier. I, I went live on Twitch while I was making YouTube videos, and the YouTube videos were, were by and large my highest priority for as far as content goes. While that was still a thing, my YouTube was doing great. As, as far as a new channel was going, I was having fun. I was making videos. I was learning new ways to edit. I was learning new editing software, different ways to record. Uh, you should have seen my janky setups, man. They were great. But then I got into streaming, and streaming, while set up and managing some things were a bit more complicated, the actual act of go online, find a game, stream you playing it, and not have to worry about editing posts and actually producing the video and thumbnails and tags and categories and scheduling and all that stuff. It seemed easier. And while growth at the very beginning of my channel was great, there were some points in there where I saw Twitch wasn't going a direction I wanted it to. And not my channel in particular, but like Twitch as a platform wasn't going the direction I liked. Like they were making crappy business decisions and stuff that was hurting streamers. And the streamer community got very toxic. It still is toxic. It's bad. Don't even pretend. It's bad. In the late 2019, I left Twitch and went to Mixer. My greatest growth, my the best time of my entire streaming career for the past seven years was the year that I took to stream on Mixer. That's when I had the most growth, the most views, the, the best gaming experiences, made the most friends, made no money, didn't give a shit about the money because it's a, cre it's a creative endeavor. It's something I, I need a creative outlet of some kind, but platform hopping, going back and forth between Twitch, Mixer, streaming on YouTube, trying out DLive and Oh, what are all the others like Trovo and Live Space and like I, I've tried at least 10 streaming platforms. None of them felt like home. They all felt like I was putting in much more work than any return I was getting back on it. And it was unf in my eyes at the time, it was unfair. Like I put in so much work and then I get literally nothing back. It wasn't, it wasn't nothing. I got friends from Twitch. I got uh, some income. I played some amazing games on, on Twitch. And I turned some of my Twitch streams into YouTube videos. That was fine. But uh, my life has gotten to a point where dedicating time, dedicating a time block several times a week to 
sitting in front of my computer and trying to be entertaining for dedicated amounts of time is wearing down on my mental health and the time with my family. And I know for a fact that making YouTube videos, while it is different work, it's not harder work. And it's a lot more flexible on when I can record, when I can edit. I work from home, so I can edit when there's not a whole lot to do at work. That said, as of this video being published, I'm done with Twitch. I won't be streaming on there anymore. I'm going to be removing it from any of my schedules, any of my stuff online. Um, I'm going to change my channel, to descrip channel description to say I don't stream here anymore. You can find me on YouTube or whatever. I'm going to take this opportunity to take a break, make videos whenever the hell I want and not be held down by a schedule for basically no viewership. I have very few dedicated friends that watch me on Twitch and there's been absolutely no growth for over two years. And in seven years of doing this, I know taking breaks because my, like I had kids born in certain times and like taking breaks because of my own mental health because I was moving across the country for I, because of various things. Taking breaks as a streamer for extended periods of time will kill your channel. I basically did everything wrong as a streamer. <laughs> But I know I can do things right as a YouTuber. I know I can. And while they won't be the highest quality videos, they'll be here with me with this background sitting in my office just playing whatever game I find. I will do my best to make them as entertaining as I possibly can. Playing games that I actually enjoy showcasing developers that I think deserve your attention. So that's what I'm setting out to do. Going back to my roots. No more streaming. Unless it's a very special event, then I'll stream on YouTube. Here. <laughs> if you're currently a subscriber on my Twitch channel, like you're paying for a sub, just go ahead and cancel that. While I appreciate the support, monetary support, I won't be streaming there anymore. So there's no need to continue that. Um, I'm going to go through all my socials. I'm going to go through all of the, the off-platform support stuff that I have and remove those as well. I look forward to playing some really fun games. I have a lot of stuff planned for this channel. I have things in my backlog for videos I've wanted to make for literal years that I didn't have time for because of family and streaming. Now I have time for it. Now I can do stuff. So thank you all so much for watching and hanging out. I appreciate you no matter what platform you're on, no matter what kind of support you show, even if you're new here, especially if you're new here, subscribe, ring the bell, make sure you tune in because I have so much planned. Having it planned and actually doing it are two very different things, but you know, but that's going to be it. I'll see you guys in the next one.